Okay, not having it in the Game Caviar Studios. I'm back with a new game that you'll probably never, ever, ever, ever see on this channel again. Body count. Body count. This is not the body count that you may think. This isn't a body count that came out a couple months ago. This damn well sure enough isn't a body count that came out on current gen consoles. No, this is body count. You remember the old game body count from uh, the old days. This is on Sega. And basically it's just a uh, like a rail shooter type game. All you can see is your crosshair and you have to shoot the enemies as well as uh, what is it? The ammo that drops down and the uh, like power-ups and whatnot and grenades. This is how you replenish your ammo by shooting it on the screen. I was thinking around with this game for about 10 minutes or so. It get it got kind of annoying after a while. But every now and again, it feels good to go back and pay homage to the old video games. So I play them periodically and I usually have a good time. This game right here got pretty repetitive. I didn't quite understand what I needed to do, but like right here where you see him shooting those purple electric orbs at me and that spider shooting that, uh, well, spitting that green goo at me. If you shoot it before it hits you, then it, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't affect you. It'll go away. I had to learn that the hard way, especially in the boss battle at the end. You'll find out. I died a couple times. The, th the good thing about this game is that they give you a lot of health. A lot of health well not a lot of, well a lot of health and a lot of continues so I don't know I had I tinkered around with it for a couple time for a couple minutes and I had a fairly decent time see right there about to shoot those bullets uh if you press I don't know, it's on Sega Genesis so you only had three buttons I know if you press C then that's how you shoot a grenade maybe it's B I don't know anyway I know I haven't put up a video in a little while because I have been very busy these past couple weeks with school and with work and everything. So here it is. I've, I figured I'd get on here and I'd make a video for everybody. I know the uh, Modern Warfare 3 Blackout video has gotten a lot of attention and there's a lot of people out there that, that watched the video and completely understood what I was saying. Um, and there's some people that just are hardcore COD is God rollers. like. If you say anything bad about Call of Duty, they want to steal your soul. I mean, they literally want to find you and kidnap you and make you dig your own grave. Those type of people are weird, man. I, I don't understand. Like, I've talked about this before and I've, I, in a past, <clears throat> whoa, excuse me, in a past video. And those types of people are just weird to me. I, I, I understand that you feel so good about something and you have such a passion for something and you, you want to stand up and fight? These people want to fight me through YouTube. And that's fine, but don't do it over a video game that's proven to be flawed. And don't stand up for a company that's proven to not care about the, uh, their, their consumers. I mean, really? Come on, man. It's something is... I don't know. I don't understand. I just want to, like, sit down and talk to people who take a person that's like a hardcore cod fan and be like just ask them why like why do you care so much about this game why 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 that's what i would like to know maybe i don't know if you had any sort of um confrontations with people like that please share them let me know it baffles my mind every time i i hear somebody say something like oh they go off into some tangent like Oh my God! You, you! I can't believe you said that about COD. And one person was like, "Sure, it's got some flaws in it, but you have to overlook that." No, I'm not gonna overlook when I'm shooting at somebody and the bullets don't hit them. I can't overlook that. That's ridiculous, man. Like seriously, I was playing GoldenEye 007 Reloader earlier today online, and it's still laggy. But if I shot somebody, if I shot at somebody, I hit them. There's certain things like that, man. It's just weird. When you have a shooting game that's based on shooting other people, if that part of the game is not perfected to the point where it's, if it messes up, it's not noticeable, then your whole foundation is just screwed, man. It's like building a house on the ground, on the dirt. You have to put a foundation down before you put your house down. Otherwise, the house is going to fall over. And COD right now is falling over. It's crazy. 
I was playing earlier today and man it was crazy like I was playing uh what is it kill confirmed hardcore kill confirmed hardcore hardcore and I was literally getting uh hit markers on people at least two and that same person would take two shots they didn't have a, a vest on or anything like that because the icon didn't show up they literally would take two shots from me and then kill me with one shot in hardcore I, I did not it baffled my mind like it confused me so bad I didn't even get angry at it it was just like what is it? why have they not done anything about this and before I played the game they had an update so every time the game updates I cross my fingers I'm like maybe 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 this time this is the one maybe does anybody else do that too when you when you go to play uh, a Call of Duty game and you see an update are you like maybe this is it maybe this is the uh, the holy grail of updates where we just well, we download it and it fixes everything and Call of Duty is back to the way it was and it wasn't I believe it was an update getting ready for the new maps they're gonna drop on PS3 blah 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 whatever whatever so anywho I played about an hour hour and a half on my uh, main PSN account um, I'm trying to get back into the groove of things and uh, get on um, get back into playing with my my clan mates but it makes it hard to do it when the game is just so crappy I mean it, it really does and I don't really know what to do about that the dude really I mean I felt the heat coming through the through the uh, through the screen he was like look man of course it's got all these little mistakes in it of course of course maybe it does have all these mistakes you talk about maybe it does but you gotta overlook it gotta overlook it quit whining about it I'm like dude are you serious if I, it's a shooting game and I'm shooting at somebody and my bullets don't hit them I'm not whining I'm complaining and justly and, and rightfully so anyway like comment subscribe spread the word I'm not having it game caviar studio and I'm out